I'm presenting what a middleware solution can bring to uh, the industry. Our solution is such that it's not a plugin to an existing application. They just need to copy a simple file into their applications and in real time, when they start the application, we will grab the content, the 3D model of this application and display that in the virtual reality environment. We are able to easily grab the content developed by engineers in the industry directly and in real time inside the HMDs. The 6DOF tracking provided with the HTC is a necessity if you want to bring the human being inside the VR environment. Today I've got NVIDIA Quadro P6000, the best graphical card on the market, so I'm able to show a bigger model that I would be able to do with a smaller graphical card. I've got a model of a paper machine, so it's uh, some kind of big machine that could be placed inside a factory. First of all, our middleware solution, this directly in that inside the HTC so that can be used for engineering uh, review or for uh, let's say a review with your customer for example. The HMD allows you to have that 360 view so that I can feel really immersed inside the environment. I can basically go there and try for example as I was talking about the clearance and reachability process. Thanks to also that track device I'm able to for example perform an action and see that in the future, will I be able to get through that uh, bar and get access to the hatch here. So that one-to-one -one scale relation with the models allows me to foresee, for example, some maintenance operation in the future. So this is one of the possible scenario. The model is still under development. And what I'm doing here is that I'm forcing that if in the future I want to access that black hatch here, I can see that my hand, it will be difficult to get inside. For example, if I get some tools, you can see that to access inside with my tools won't be easy. So one of the ideas would be to move, to, to change the model at the early stage of the process so as to avoid mistakes in the future. If you look clearly, what we can see is that the cylinder, they enter into each other. Was it made on purpose or not? At least I was able to easily see that mistake and I would ask my engineer either to modify it or to explain me why it was not like this. You can work at the same time and use the VR as a process and take benefit of it so as to improve your product, less error, better communication so that it will result in a faster um, release on the market.